Good morning, the KO Kids. What an awesome day it is. You want to know why? Because today is a day that God has given us, which means it's a present. It's a gift. And we want to just thank God for giving us another day to just worship him, to love him, to give him praise and glory. Right now where you are, can you just say, thank you, Jesus? Yeah. Can you say, God, I love you. Let me hear you. Yes, God, we love you. God, we thank you for just another day to just to have the opportunity to worship you, to praise you, and to give you all of the glory. Listen, I am so happy that you chose to join in with me this morning to worship. I am so excited that you chose to be here. Listen, we have a really fun thing this morning. So I know a lot of you guys like to do things like the Cupid Shuffle, the cha-cha slide, wobbling here and there, whatever it is. But listen, this song, our first worship song, is called the Power Shuffle because God has given us power. He's given us power, power to move our arms, power to move our legs, power to sing praises to him. So we're going to jump into this worship song called the Power Shuffle. What I need you to do is I need, you, I need, I need you to get up. You're going to wake up your body. You're going to move around a little bit. You're going to clap a little bit because we are going to use the power that God has given us. Let's go. Everybody clap your hands. Now stop. Yeah, that was awesome, was it? Listen, I'm a little tired now, but I got to keep going. We got to keep praising. Our next song just talks about that no matter what, God's love remains. His love, it never fails. It will never give up on you. 
So let's go into that because God's love is so great. So before we jump in, can I just hear you again say, God, I love you. Thank you for loving me. Come on, let's go sing about it. Awesome song. 
Listen, kids, I want you to know one thing, and that is that God loves you. He loves you with everything. God loves you. He loves us. So right now, God, we just want to thank you, Lord. Thank you for your love. Thank you for your love that just covers us wherever we go. And God, we just thank you that you choose us to love. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. That is so, so great to know that God loves us. Listen, today we are going to dive into a new bold word. You remember our bold words from last week? Well, this week's bold word is listen. Yeah, yeah. How many of you is that kind of a struggle for? Listening? Sometimes it's hard to listen to your parents. Yeah, but I want to talk about listening to God's voice. Listen, this is our big idea. You ready? Your big idea is that God wants to speak to me if I will listen to him. God wants to speak to you. He wants to hear from you. He wants you to hear his voice. He wants to have a relationship with you. Now, I have this really cool thing here. Do any of you know what this is? Is it a cell phone? No, it's not a cell phone. It's not a walkie talkie. It's a radio, a radio. And listen, have you guys ever heard about airwaves and radio waves? Yeah? Can you see airwaves and radio waves? No, but they're all right here. Let's take a listen. Okay. And then you can go through the airwaves and the radio waves to see. Okay. Okay. Let's see what else is out there. Huh, maybe this will help. Gotta get the antenna up. Maybe not that one. Okay, <laughs> all right, listen, just like those radio waves, God is around us and he wants to speak to us. It even says it in our scripture today. Listen, in John 10 uh, verses 27 and 28, it says, my sheep listen to my voice. That's us. We're Jesus's sheep. He's our shepherd. And, he, and then he says, I know them and they follow me. I give them eternal life and they will never perish. No one can snatch them away from me. That's Jesus talking about us. So what he's saying is, is that as we try to grow in tune with him, we begin to know his voice more. We want to hear from him. We want Jesus and we want God to tell us where to go, how to be, and how to live. All we have to do is listen. We have to tune in, just like this radio. Listen, boys and girls, there are a lot of other things that you can tune into. There are so many things that want to get your attention. Just like on this radio, there are many stations that want to get our attention. But what we have to do is listen to God's voice. We have to drown out everything. We have to take away some things. We have to do what we can to listen to his voice because he wants to speak to you. Yeah, you. He wants to speak to you. He wants to speak to me. So right now, we are going to pray that our ears and our minds and our hearts can be open to what God wants to say to us and that we listen to him. Let's pray. Dear God, thank you so much for choosing us to speak to. God, I pray that you continue to open up our ears to know your voice, to tune into your voice. God, I pray that your voice becomes so clear in our hearts and in our minds so that we can hear from you. This I pray in Jesus' name, amen. Listen, this week, this is what I want you to do. 
I want you to do things to grow your antenna, okay? Whether that's spending more time in your word, whether that's spending more time praying, do more things to grow your antenna to make God's voice so clear in your heart and in your mind, okay? Now listen, I'm going to go and I'm going to see what God wants me to hear from him, okay? And let's do all of that together, okay? So this is what I need you to do. You see this link right here? nikeochurch.org slash kidsresources. You can go there and you can get an activity sheet to follow along in main worship service, okay? Got it? All right, you got to do that activity sheet to keep up with Pastor Brian because you know he's preaching hard. So we're going to follow that activity sheet. But to get to the main worship service, follow this link right here. And it's even in the description, okay? Follow that link. And I'm going to go over there and we're all going to worship together. I want you to worship with your families. We're going to sing praises to God. And then we're going to listen to what God has to say through Pastor Brian. All right, listen, kids, I love you so much. I cannot wait to see you again. But remember, God loves you. God wants you to know that he loves you, all right? We'll see you guys soon.